When was the last time you looked up? When was the last time you ventured out on a dark, cold evening, your sole purpose being to look up at the stars, to look up and wonder? Many people do look up, but not enough, nowhere near enough. There is something so special about the universe, we are it. We were born from it. We are all part of the collective consciousness, shaping and moulding it in our every thought and action. Science now proves this. We are on a planet that is travelling through space at thousands of miles an hour, in a universe that stretches on forever. How can we know where we're going as a race if we have no idea where we came from? It's all if buts and maybes, and the majority of people don't care where we came from. My heart saddens for these people. Too many people are blindly passing through this reality with their heads down looking at their feet, engrossed in a world of narcissism, enslaved by what they are told through a black box in the corner of a box-shaped living room by a presenter with a pretty face, unnoticing the beauty all around them. They are missing out on so much life, fun, excitement, exhilaration, and my god so much beauty. They just don't realize it. Money can't buy you these things. I knew from an early age that there was something missing in life. Something always seemed just around the corner, just out of arm's length. I could never quite grab it, but I kept searching. This something kept nagging away at me, and no matter where I looked, I just couldn't find it. At school as a child, I was the one who kept asking where we came from, why we were here, what was the purpose of our existence. But no one could answer. No one would even try to answer. They didn't know. I would discuss these questions with my friends at school and we would make up stories about where we came from and where humanity would be in the future. We would act them out in the evenings at each other's homes. We had no Xbox to plug our minds into. We were outside playing until dark, health and safety be damned. Humanity is heading in such a dangerous direction at the moment and the vast majority are too blind to see it. They are too caught up in themselves to see, and even if they could see, I doubt they would care. Humanity has changed. People are scared constantly. Scared they won't have enough to eat. Scared they can't pay their bills. Scared they might lose their job. Scared for the safety of their children. Scared of their neighbors. I'm here to tell you that being scared is a state of mind. It's a choice. You are a creation of the infinite universe. You are infinite consciousness having an experience. It's all an illusion. Nothing matters. You are scared because you are told to be scared. We have been manipulated since birth, propagandized by the elite from the day we came into this world into being their slaves. We are choosing our own slavery because as a people, we have been taught to value things that really don't matter and to somehow fear someone who has a different version to that of the official line of anything. In order for us to truly be free, you have to break through this manipulation and realize that nothing matters. We were all born into this world and we will all die and remove ourselves from this dimension. In between these events, why cower in the corner? Stand up, take a deep breath and live life. It's there waiting for you. Now go and get it. Go and start doing the things your soul is yearning for, and let's all collectively help humanity to the next level.